Uh, welcome everybody. Yeah, we're in the Araneta Mall and we're heading to Chinatown. Chinatown! We've gotten a lot of requests to go to Chinatown, so it's finally this day. Another place that's highly requested that we're finally going to. Technically, we're actually going to Manila first, so Chinatown might actually be the next video, but that's the goal of today is to get to Chinatown. And uh, we have something to send in the post, but for some reason the post office here is closed and it's only 2.30. So On a Friday, which it shouldn't be, I don't think. So we're going to the Manila post office and we're gonna get to see downtown Manila for the first time for the first impressions of Manila. Let's see how it is. Let's do it. To the LRT, baby. We're in Manila. The streets of Manila. It's not the streets of Manila without wires. You need the wires. If there's no wires, what are you doing? Well, we're heading to the LRT line one now. We wrote, after we get on that one, we're gonna ride every single LRT slash MRT. Are we ride. true Filipino Manilians now? I think we're Manilians. Very. Qui-Ganians. Oh, I like to be Qui-Ganians more. He is the rescuer of the galaxy. I've never seen a bridge in between buildings before. Those poor people have their like windows faced at this. Then, imagine if you wanted to sleep in today and this is all you could hear. That would really suck, it's so loud. Hey, but maybe once you listen to it long enough, this is the only thing that can put you to sleep. True, it becomes like a hypnotizing type of thing. Uh, yum. Oh, a b-ball game? Very epic. Let's go join. You can probably slither through this little gap right here. That's a jail? It looks like there's blood. Uh, it definitely is the jail. And everyone was wearing yellow. Maybe let's not join the game anymore. We still could, you know. Uh, we have to get in there. That's what happens when we don't renew our visas. We'll join their basketball game. Oh, maybe that would be a good title for a video. We went to jail in the Philippines? And then the next video, playing basketball with the inmates in the Philippines? I'm glad they let us bring in our GoPro. Yeah, they probably will. We're still working on getting mics for our GoPro. Um, we don't know how to deliver it. There's, we can't get Amazon or GoPro doesn't deliver here either. So if you know how to deliver, let us know. Thank you, Manila. Very epic. Welcome to Manila. We're pretty close to like right downtown here. I heart a roar of a row craze. That's my favorite neighborhood. Hey. <laughs> uh, okay. We're trying to get to the post office. We'll see how this goes. There's a nice little forest park right here. Look at that. It looks pretty epic, actually. We should go in there. And this fountain is also pretty epic. Wow, they actually have fountains on? Uh, Qui-Gon City didn't have their fountains on. Over here. There's an opening right there. How do we cross the road? I don't know. Are we gonna die? We just broke every single rule. Oh, oh that me. sun. Woohoo! We're gonna be. If you thought we walked a lot so far, we may be walking even more today. I don't know. MOA, we got up to like 10 miles, so maybe not, but we'll see. How do we cross the street here? Went for it. Maybe we also have to go for it. Hey guys, welcome to Isaac's vlog. Today I'm gonna be showing you a street. Well, we need to cross two this size oh. and go over there. You know what that means. Epic parkour. Oh! Right, running, jumping all in one, and then also rolling across to get to the other side. You gotta do the parkour jump too, where you like put the two hands on it and then you flip your legs over. Oh no, he's got the parkour hat on. I'm ready. It's sunny out today. It's very sunny. <laughs> Oh yeah, nice, we're on the island. I feel like I'm in the streets of Mangalore. Somebody just yelled, hey. hey. We have a gap. A medium, <laughs> we have a gap. Will we die? Wow, this guy's really taking his crack in time. Holy nuts, he's going slow. Run! Hey. We made it. 
very epic. Thank you, Qui Gon. Huh. Is this gonna turn the right way? Uh, hopefully. Is that the street up there that we also have to cross, or what? Possibly. Is that hey. Dougie? Dougie? Dougie, Dougie McCarthy? MacArthur? Wow. Dougie of McCarthy. He, McCarthy. He was a very aggressive general. He stormed into China. Good idea. Ah! Ah! Maybe North Korea wouldn't exist right now if it wasn't for <laughs> McCarthy. <laughs> Let's see him. We're getting uh, a lot of highs from like across streets and like from places we don't even know where they're coming from. No, it's just like, it's like when you hear it from a random apartment building, hi! <laughs> that was in our Mangalore video if you guys saw that one. And we're like, what the crap is that? <laughs> and then he got his whole, it was like a dorm. He got the whole dorm out to say hi. Douglas, wow, look at those sick glasses. He looks like he's ready to do some science experiments. Oh, Douglas, are you scientist? You sly scientist! <laughs> Rip Douglas. I, I think he just died of old age. I don't even correct it, no. Uh, I just know it's Douglas. Oh, <laughs> uh, tall right. building. Part two, baby. Boy, this is our chance! Go, go, go! We go made right it to now. the island. Oh, we maybe could have sprinted very quickly. Here we go! Dun, 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 dun. Wow, we made it. Very epic. Now, which way do we go now? Are you gonna yell something at us? I don't know, it might have been them too, I can't hear. It's just chaos. Probably that way, quickest. Will it be open? We're about to find out. So far, government services here have been all right. Oh. <sighs> oh, there's a statue of a post, a mailman up there. That Is might that be gonna in. be the post office? <laughs> post office. It's nice and warm today again. Getting a little sweaty. Bro, it's, it's perfect temperature. I'm used to it. Oh. Not the tundras. It's not the tundras where we're from. My, I'm not sweating at all, actually. My shirt isn't sticking to myself or to my back at all. Yeah, no, me neither, me neither. I wasn't sweating even just on the air-conditioned MRT oh. and LRT and LRT. This is a fracking fancy post office, baby. Are we gonna be able to mail our thing here? <laughs> well, there's a picture of a mailman. Yeah, we better be. <laughs> all right, let's mail this fracker. It's a, it's a mail corporate office. We can't. They'll be like, oh, you can't actually send anything. You're supposed to go to a different office today. Then we'll go out and be like, oh, there's a picture of a mailman. Yeah, can we just give it to him? What the frack is your problem? Time to mail. So apparently the Philippines Post doesn't ship to the country of Georgia. That's very unfortunate for us. Uh, now we're going to have to figure out how we're going to ship that over. It's literally the post office of the Philippines. The main office, too. Right. They only ship to like 40-something countries. How the frack do we get this? Anyways, nice fountain. Hey, this is a nice little area. Hey, the post office, they got to build a fountain, but they can't ship to Georgia. She didn't know what Georgia was. She didn't, she, hey, she thought it was her. in the US. I don't blame her to be honest. <laughs> no. Not many people do. No, we didn't really know about Georgia until we went there, before we went there. All right, well. Is that Bonifacio? Holy, that's AGC's, AGC, AC Bonifacio's dad? I can take this thing off. It's fracking hot. It's really hot. Woo! All right, well, let's go into this thing. What the frack is this? Department of Engineering and Public Works. Our first impressions of Manila? We can't mail? <laughs> Come on, Manila. Not epic. Wow. <laughs> we are in this epic place. Oh, there's a ball. It's like, well, it was the Earth before the blackness. The blackness. It was the magma planet of oh. Earth. There's a lot of them. Oh. Meow. Meow. I don't really know where we are, but we're just walking the streets of Manila, baby. Our only objective today was uh, to get to the post office and get to Chinatown. And we are 50% complete, so now we're just walking. <sighs> Great. Another thing to have to do now. Guys, this is, uh, this wall is sponsored by Pepsi. 
Wow. Pepsi sponsors SB19 and walls. I don't know how the kids' feet got there, but they're there. They were drop kicking the wall. <laughs> oh, that would hurt. They saw a Marvel movie and they're like, I could bust through this wall. <laughs> Here. Maybe this way. This way we go. Let's go, baby. So Intramuros apparently is that way. Um, but we're going to be saving that for another day, most likely. Everything closes at 5 and it's already 4. So, eh, bad idea. The post office closed. We were the last people in the post office before she shut her door. And this place looks like it's closed too. That's very closed. Hey, if you're in Manila, you got to start early. All right, everybody. <laughs> we're walking. I saw the monument on the map and there it is. Does that say KKK? That's fracking racist. The frack, Philippines. I expect every country to abide by American history. KKK. That's bad in the U.S. So why wow. do they have it here? This is disgraceful, Philippines. <laughs> Philippines. What the? That's so racist. The frack. Disgusted. Disgusted. And appalled. We're leaving this country at once. <laughs> why New we left the Philippines? New title of video with us dramatically sitting. That's pretty sick, though. I'm guessing that's old Bonifacio. Yeah, that's really cool. And we got like the KKK, whatever that means. Uh, you have the huts. That is quite epic, one could say. You got people with guns. Are those Philippines eagles right there? You can't get very close to it or else nobody is getting close to it. I don't know. Wow, there's suddenly a lot of people here. Where are we? Is there something on the back? Is it a, it is a double sided? We get a double sided monument though? It better be double sided or I'll be very epically disappointed. Oh, there's some rocks. There's a thing. It's double sided, baby. <gasps> oh, it's just a little paragraph. A oh, reading? Reading? That's for children. It's not in our language. KKK. Cartilia Nig NG's is not is not K. No, that's just an N. Why isn't it K N K? The frack? Caution men at work. I mean, I don't know why they're excluding the women. There could be a woman in there working. There's not. <laughs> All right. See, like, a lot of people are still wearing masks. Mine is broken now. Would you like to see a demonstration of how we wear these when they break? They break a lot. And then you just gotta squeeze them extra tight on your nozzle. And perfect. <laughs> There's a lot of people in this park. Look, at everybody's wearing masks. Dun, 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 dun. Wow, this place got real busy real quick. Oh, what the frick is going on over there? Let's see. I don't know if you've been to the Philippines before, but if well, there's one thing I know about the Philippines, is SM owns everything. They own literally everything. Every block is SM, baby. They even have like government services in their mall. We didn't even know this was here. And we're going into SM City Manila right now. Well, let's go. All right. Mail. That is us. <laughs> It's much nicer temperature-wise in here. Really That's cool. for sure. Yeah, we have to cool off before we go back out and then go to Chinatown. Oh, this mall looks... Look at Christmas. It's Christmas in the building? Whoa. It's pretty busy. That was like one of the busier malls we've been to. Yeah, the downtown has got a different amount of people, it seems. Yeah. Even it's... though Qui-Gon City is the most populated. It's bigger? more spread out but there's a lot of people here dang i did not wear the right kind of underwear they're oh, scrunching no. up the scrunchers is happening this is never good if your underwear is scrunching especially when it's sweaty i'm glad now everyone in the video knows that about you just everyone look into my eyes you can feel the pain of scrunchy underwear i do not have scrunchy underwear but you can look into my eyes as well phantom man that's about to have scrunchies. No! <laughs> oh, Frank. I made too much noise and my mask blew off. We're gonna get kicked out of here and banned and deported. No! It's just a broken mask. 
Well, they have a Pizza Hut, a French Baker, and a McDonald's. And a food court. All right, food court time. Let's go. Got some? We've, we've been told. We've got some potato corner. Oh, we've been told to go to potato corner a few times, and we're in the mall in Manila for the first time, and we saw a nice potato corner. We're, we're trying to get a snack before we go to Chinatown, too. I need so. some Chinese food, baby. We don't want a full meal yet. No. So, potatoes, and there's a lot more than I expected. And look at how fracking orange these babies are. Wow, that's orange. They're so still orange, it got on my bed. Oh. The reveal? Wow, those are green and white. They're nice and fresh, though. They, we got a fresh batch of oh. these. All right, let's try potato corner. There is a fry shortage here. So this is the first time we've gotten fries in a while. It is. Fry shortage. Fry shortage Manila. The most intense moment ever. Okay. They are very sour creamy and oniony. Oh, yum yum. But they're they're warm and they're crunchy, which is like a first. I, I don't know the last time I've had warm and crunchy fries that have been like warm, warm. We order a lot of uh, food panda fries. Those are so good, but they're also going to be way too much. I can't imagine getting any bigger size. So you kind of got the bucket and then nope. ate it like a cow in a trough. My face just covered in white and green powder. You'd look, if it was these ones, you'd look like a wolf that just <laughs> got its kill. Look at how bright orange these are. These cannot be healthy. They look a bit less bright orange on the GoPro, but they're like Cheeto orange. They are literally, they kind of taste like Cheetos. Really? Any, you're tasting the MSG in there? Oh, I am. Yum, MSG. My favorite flavor. It tastes like Kraft Mac and Cheese. Oh, Which that is makes... the pinnacle of MSG cheese. Oh, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. It looks like it. Wow, that's yummy. That's yummy, though. I mean, sometimes when I make mac and cheese, I'll pour it on, and then I'll make like a little mound, and then I'll just take a little nibble of it. Really? Yeah. I see it. When I make craft, I just pour the package into my mouth, and then and just then eat um, the milky show. The milky noodles by itself. Oh with some butter in there. It's really, really delicious. But Potato Corner is delicious as well. Yum, we need a drink. We were thirsty before we got them. Now we're even more thirsty. Yummy, yummy, yummy. The first, we had to get some fruit drink. I got a, we both got a summer strawberry pudding smoothie. That sounds so delicious. It does sound very delicious. We'll see how it is. It better be thirst quenching, that's all I can say. I'm thirsty as nuts now. This place is so busy. This must be a pretty old one. I would assume so. It's right in downtown and it's literally called SM City Manila. Is it the OG? Is it the OG? What's the first mall? <gasps> Look at these, aren't these delicious? Mai Mai? She watched one of our videos before. She knows who we are. Even wow. She probably doesn't remember us at all. We reacted to her song and she watched it. Just like Jackson Wang. And Jay Park. Hey, thanks. And F Hero. Wow, we're so famous. So famous. <laughs> Don't worry, you guys, we got this tea live. It looks really yummy. It might be the best thing we've ever had in our entire lives. Really? You never know. You never know. All right, give it, let's go in this corner and give it a sip. That's a good mask. Thank you, I designed it myself. You had a pudding show. I did. The bottom egg is all pudding, but like a little bit of strawberry seeped in there. That's that's very really good. It's it very sweet. You didn't mix mix it, bro. I didn't mix mix it enough. I, I've been trying to mix mix it, and the hole is widened, and it didn't work at all. Look, that's what happens when you mix mix. You know why? You have to do it the special way. Watch. You start at the bottom, and you go. Oh, did it work? It's looking it in my mouth. <laughs> the, the, the chunks of pudding are very big. It's not pudding that we would think of as pudding. It's uh, it's like jello almost. Yeah, like the like the stuff in the buko panda. Yeah, but um, pretty tasty. It actually tastes really yummy. The actual smoothie part has like the McDonald's smoothie. Uh -huh. McDonald's strawberry shake flavor to it, but it's like a smoothie. 
And then the pudding part is very, it's sort of like the, the cream you get in like a donut. In my, in my holo holo that I made at the Hot Pot Buffet? That too. Heck yeah, baby. Go, the, the Philippines has been bringing the tea. Or I guess this, it was from a tea place, but I don't know if this is tea. The drinks are really yummy. It was a summer whatever something, something cool. Yeah. Best milk tea I've had in the Philippines. Thank you very much, Philippines. We're at the MRT, but we still have half of our things left. Mansconi style? Brain freeze? Brain freeze style. Here we go. Go. I can't see the liquid movement. Mm. It's enough to make my mouth very cold though. All right, here we go. I'm about to get the half of this in one go. Wow. I would That's say too, about two fists probably there. It's too thick to to do that. Oh, in the ear. Yeah, I felt that earlier. Oh. It's not as enjoyable when you have to down it. No. Oh. Oh. I, I was drinking it like a liquid. I was filling my whole mouth and then you try to swallow it and it's a mass. Oh, now I feel it like freezing my stomach. We won't digest food now because our stomachs are frozen. Mex oh my gosh, it's still a fourth of it left. The Mexican food we ate yesterday made us uh, empty the bowels quicker and this will clog them back up. You guys need to hear a lot about our problems today. You're welcome. <laughs> How's the scrunching problem going right now? Fixed it. Did the old walk and tug. That could be perceived oddly. Yeah, we'll just leave it at that and I'll let you guys think whatever you think. I'm almost there. My oh no, the brain freeze is coming. I feel like I'm not going to be hungry now. This was a lot. Oh no. I was just trying to shove as much Chinese food in my stomach as I possibly can. Who would have thought you could get a brain freeze outside in this temperature? Oh, my God. oh it's so painful. Your body sweats and your mind freezes. Oh, this is so painful. There's our train. Oh, probably, and then we'll have to wait another five minutes. The sun's going down. It is. We haven't even been to China yet. But we'll be able to experience it up China. Oh, frag, this is rough. It tastes yummy. It does. It's really sweet. Really sweet. I'm sure you guys are enjoying this footage of us drinking for yeah. two and a half minutes straight. This is involuntary. Mm. Oh, it's on now. I did it. Yummy. Uh, that's all I need, baby. I'm fueled and regenerated. It really did fill up the stomach. I was hungry after you had potato corner, but now I'm not. I'm not hungry anymore either. I'm ready to shove sweet and sour and Kung Pao chicken only into my stomach now. Oh. I almost puked. <laughs> 